Lined up in the 2004 Meadowlands pace set. Here they come. And they're off in Mantacular time. The gate perfectly, and the Catman sends him. Metropolitan charging from the outside as well. And Brennan backs off Camelot Hall just a bit. He'll settle third on the inside. Circle L Kid is chased up to keep up early on. Gear to Gear is fifth at the rail as Campbell and Metropolitan drive on to the top. Georgia Pacific is two lengths further back, racing in sixth. Holborn Hanover is gapped early, stuck to his outside. Brandon's Cowboy. Times are changing his last right now. And to his inside, the Preacher. Pan 26 and 1, a wicked quarter, and Brennan makes his move with Camelot Hall, and Camelot Hall loops around Metropolitan, and he is the leader with 5 eighths left to go. Mantacular is now back racing in third, and Pierce is coming with gear to gear on the outside, and Circle L Kid gets out to follow that cover. Georgia Pacific is third over in the live flow. Holborn Hanover races in seventh. Brandon's Cowboy gaps the cover, eighth on the outside, the half and 52 and 4, and gear to gear is right alongside of Camelot Hall and these two are battling for the lead as they move around the far turn. Metropolitan third, Circle L Kid gapping cover. Following him is Georgia Pacific. He's only about four lengths away on the outside. Shuffled back the early leader. Mantacular is jammed in. Holborn Hanover racing in seventh. Then Brandon's Cowboy. Excess cover for times are changing and at the back is the Preacher Pan who trails the field. Three quarters in one, twenty and one and it's Camelot Hall as they come to the top of the stretch. Metropolitan Metropolitan now with racing room, and he starts to angle from the pocket a length and a half away. Georgia Pacific there. Times are changing. Hits his best stride on the outside. They're driving to the finish. It's Metropolitan a short lead. Holborn Hanover gunning for a big upset. Up on the outside. Times are changing. Holborn Hanover a shocker in 149 flat. Times are changing second. A photo for show. Sammy. Holborn Hanover, the fastest fourth place finisher among the eliminations, longest shot on the board, comes up the cones to win in 149, only a fifth of a second off the gelding world record, which was set a week ago, or tied a week ago rather, by times are changing with life source. Jim Morrill Jr., the biggest win of his career, John Fielding, Can America Capital Corporation of Ontario, the owners and a gelded son of Cam's Card Shark for trainer Mark Harder has just won the Meadowlands Pace, results posted official, the highest win payoff by far in Pace history, $119 to win, 31 even to place, and 1180 to show. Second, number seven, times are changing, $4.280, and third, number 10, Metropolitan, who pays $5.60, the 4.7 Exacta, 4.0580, 4.710 Tri, $4,852.20. The $1 Super of 4.7105, $11,792.40. John Fielding of Toronto, Ontario and the Can America Capital Corporation, which is a partnership made up of Douglas Hyatt of Milton, Ontario, and Albert Imbrogno. So the results are official for the 2004 Meadowlands Pace. Holborn Hanover wins it for Harder and Morrill in 149 flat.